ब्रॉड टू यू बाय एजिलस डायग्नोस्टिक्स एजिलस डायग्नोस्टिक्स व्हाट कॉजेस हेडेनिक कैंसर इन इंडिया एज यू ऑल नो एनी सिटी एनी विलेज यू विल फाइंड अ बानवाला दोस थिंग्स आर रेडली अवेलेबल दे आर चीप एंड मेनी एंड मेनी पीपल टेक अप स्मोकिंग whether it is smokeless smoking early in the age group this increases the incidence many fold if the same person is having intake of alcohol as well as tobacco the incidence and the risk factors increases if the same person is having both tobacco and alcohol at the same time the incidence of adenic cancer increases many fold we southeast asia have the highest number of adenic cancers in the world In Southeast Asia, the other common causes of adenic cancer is human papilloma virus. With the changes in cultural perspective, the incidence of HPV virus associated adenic cancer have also increased many fold. Difficulty with youngsters is they are in denial mode. They think that it cannot happen to them. The intake is more, they experiment a lot, and along with alcohol, along with tobacco, they experiment with many other things. So finding the patient in the correct time is very difficult when the youngsters are having the disease it's more aggressive they require rigorous surgery radiation chemotherapy and the results are also poor in youngsters one of the most common reason of finding the disease in advanced stages is because of lack of awareness people are in denial mode they don't expect and then do accept that this can happen to them many times patient develop non healing ulcers difficulty in swallowing there is difficulty in opening mouth there is changes in voice there is there can be some nodes in the neck these are the few common signs and symptoms of adenic cancer but youngsters they are in denial they don't accept it if we can have this disease so that is why they come late to us the diagnosis is delayed and they are diagnosed at advanced stages and because they are diagnosed at advanced stages the treatment is difficult and they require multidisciplinary approach radical surgery radical rt plus minus chemotherapy and targeted therapy many times patients ask us whether the hidden cancer is a genetic cancer or not yes to some extent it may be true also you may not be smoking anything you may not be drinking but many times you get the disease why you have not done anything wrong but you have a genes you have a genetic makeup which is made up of your parents your grandparents so when they smoked in their lifetime they caused genetic defects in themselves and those genetic defects they didn't interpret they didn't came up in their own life but they passed it on to generations to your father to yourself and that genetic defect now has become a cancer so to prevent ourselves and our future generations we should stop smoking and taking alcohol in any form in nutshell the adenic cancer can be prevented if we can have no tobacco or alcohol in any form i have seen patients who are elderly who are taking a paste of tobacco and they are doing it five to six times a day because that addiction is there and they think that they cannot stop this so we have to stop tobacco in all forms whether it is smokeless or smoking video cigarettes secondly if the person is having alcohol as well as tobacco intake the incidence is high so we have to make them aware that if you are taking tobacco not only your adenic cancer incidence is more not only the lung cancer there are many cancers which are associated with tobacco to prevent our future generations for uh, from intake of tobacco in any form we should stop any sort of advertisement in any of the public platforms all children below the age of 20 once they should be prohibited for any uh, buying of tobacco and its products it should not be available in and around public places it should the and smoking as well as alcohol in outside area in public places should be completely banned